Welcome, I'm Dragon, and today I'm going to be doing a quicker video on how to add a raft and settings that worked well with the raft. I normally don't like using them, but recently I had a print that needed one, but the raft was surprisingly painful to remove, so I did some experimenting and found something that worked better without losing too much quality on the first layer. So with that, let's get into it. First, turn on the raft in printer settings by clicking generate support material and changing the layers. I personally use two, but now for the settings for easier removal, change the contact Z distance to a minimum of 0.2 where it says detachable. It's actually a setting that you can just click. But for me, that still doesn't work that great. So I would recommend increasing that to 0.4. In my experience, anything higher than that starts rapidly decreasing quality on the first layer. Because literally what it's doing is increasing the distance it's touching the raft. So there's a little bit of a gap between the model and the raft. And that is how these things work. Well, there we have it. I hope this helped you out. If you would like to see the results from my testing, then here you go. So I tried 0.2 millimeters, and I tried 0.3 millimeters, 0.4 millimeters, and 0.6 millimeters. As you can see, 0.6 millimeters kind of started to lose print quality, so that is why I'm recommending 0.4 millimeters for the contact Z distance. Well, I hope this helped, and bye!